Hey everybody, thanks for joining Kep One Art. I uh, appreciate you uh, taking the time to watch this video. Uh, this is an ink and canvas and the title of this painting is called Piled On. And um, I'll post a picture uh, to show you what I'm using to uh, record this and uh, post some links and uh, whatnot of some of the supplies that I use for this painting. So let's just get right into it. Uh, once again, thanks for joining. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button, all right? So here we go. So uh, this is a 16 by 24 canvas purchased through Michaels. Um, I usually uh, stock up when they uh, have those sales. I believe they're like two for like five or two for 10 bucks. I mean, you can't beat it. $5 um, a canvas, pre-primed, ready to go. Um, as you can see from the background, uh, I just sometimes, you know, I, when I don't go to those fancy, um, uh, you know, uh, art stores uh, that have all the cool uh, new new days of uh, paint cans and all that good stuff. I just go to Home Depot and I buy the uh, Krylon fluorescent. And uh, from the background, you can see that, um, you know, I'll just do some cool fades in there. They're all stock tips. I don't really use any of the uh, fancy tips and all that stuff. Um, not unless I'm painting a wall or something. But um, this video is going to go real quick. I condensed it all. Um, some of these clips were really like 17 minutes long. But uh, I went ahead and just condensed everything for you. Because um, I know the attention span is very long for, for everybody, even for myself. So, uh, real quick, just went through a, a blue pencil outline, took that outline, took one of my uh, fine point brushes, just used some black India ink, and uh, went through all the outlining, just, just like you would do a comic book almost. Uh, that's kind of how I paint um, when it comes to this type of uh, style. It's just uh, ink and canvas, and um, you know, I just do the basics, you know, pencil outline outline of black ink and then go in and just fill in all the uh, the solid uh, black that I can and then go through all the details um, but I really enjoy this process it's it's pretty simple when it comes down to just uh, how to do it um, but it really just comes down to creativity and what you can make but I really love the way that the cool blends in the background um, kind of contrast against the solid black and I, I really really dig that um, uh, vibe and you'll see a lot of my paintings are are kind of in that style. Uh, I usually paint like this live uh, simply because it's just the easiest, fastest way to, to you know get to point A to point B. Uh, but you see here already, I'm already getting down to the point where I'm getting in some fine detail. Uh, went through all the outlining, did the thick outlining, uh, very similar to graffiti piecing, you know, same same style that I do for painting here. Um, going through all the little details, and uh, it was summer, didn't have my shirt on, so uh, hey. That's just what happens when it gets hot, right? So um, you're just going through everything and uh, just, you know, fine detailing. And, and here's a, almost a finished product. I think that um, I just had a little bit left to do, um, which I don't think I recorded. I was running out of battery at the time. But anyways, so here, here it is piled on. Uh, let me know if you have any questions in regards to the process or, you know, I'm an open book. I don't, I don't mind talking to people, letting them know what I use um, as far as, uh, you know, supplies or techniques or whatever. Um, but uh, yeah, leave some comments down there. If you like it, you like it, let me know. Art gonna be posting a lot of these and don't forget to subscribe hit that button right there in the corner uh, I should have my little watermark right there so that you can subscribe to the channel that would help out follow me on Instagram at kept one art and uh, we'll see you next time <laughs>